Hi, this video is to show our PVC air horn. It's uh, made to sound like a Nathan K3LA train horn. We got the plans from Dozer Boy Miller. You can find his videos elsewhere here on YouTube. But we want to make this video to show you some uh, little tricks that we figured out to make the construction easier. The first involves where to put in the airline. Dozer Boy says to put it on the top on this part right here. If you drill the hole here though, you also have to go through some complicated grinding on the parts on the inside. We found that if you put the air inlet here on the slope part of the reducer fitting, it works great. There, you put it exactly in the middle between these two, two points. It doesn't interfere with anything on the inside of uh, the working of the air chamber. Now let's turn it around and see the back. We made our manifold out of PVC also. It's just a pipe and the two end caps. And for our valve, our air valve, we used a one quarter inch ball valve. We got it from Harbor Freight, I think it's for around three, four dollars, something like that. On this end we have a quick connect for the air compressor and uh, to connect it into the manifold, it's a quarter inch to quarter inch threaded fitting. All these fittings we use Teflon tape on it to uh, make them airtight. And for the mount, we just made this out of wood, drilled a hole straight in the bottom of these three air chambers, and used a bolt in a nut. We're also going to make a video to show you how to tune these with a uh, trumpet tuner. And we will make another video to show you what it sounds like. Alright, thanks a lot for watching this video.